with 56 points separating Rangers and bottom club Dundee United. Last night's game should have been a formality for the SPL leaders. But Stuart Duff silenced the Ibrox crowd after just eight minutes when he put the Scottish Cup finalists ahead. Despite the incentive of moving into a four-point lead over Celtic at the top, Rangers were unable to turn the game round. They squandered a number of glorious chances, including this astonishing 19th-minute miss from striker Dado Persho. With United keeper Tony Bullock in inspired form two, the visitors hung on for a vital win. The result gives Celtic the initiative in the title race, moves United off the foot of the table and increases interim boss Gordon Chisholm's chances of landing the job full-time. It, it can do me no harm uh, tonight. Absolutely excellent result. But I think, again, is... Uh, the, most, the, the priority right now is that, that we, we don't go down, you know, we stay in the SPL, so that's what I'll be working, that's what I'll be doing right now, I'll be concentrating on that. Races can be as dramatic as any other. Stuart Duff's early goal against Rangers not only took Dundee United off the bottom of the league team. The heads could have gone down. Well, uh, I mean, they're, they're unbelievable. I, I actually think a, a team lacking self-assurance will miss these chances. And that's the comparison I'm trying to draw between Celtic and Rangers at the moment. There's this lack of self-assurance about, about Rangers, despite the fact that they've uh, clawed their way back from a terrible start to the season. They are an improved side, mm. but I, I still see flaws in their side that might be crucial.